streaming now. You just gotta and, register with your email uh, and password. Set up basically through I'm actually website. streaming now. So I'm actually uh, setting up the the servers when I uh, my Hitbox is streaming right now, as you see, and my Twitch TV will be streaming as well. If I go back here, you'll notice I'm streaming on Twitch, and it will say my YouTube's online. And these two are connecting. Basically, you're gonna log in, and uh, it has a whole bunch of servers you can add or set up. It's really easy to use. You basically click on the things you want. I actually like adding a, another option. You uh, select basically what you want to add. If you want to add your Twitch, you'll select the Twitch server and you'll select whatever server you have closest to you. For example, I live in the Bay Area, so I'm going to want to select something close by. I know they have a San Francisco server. And you're just going to put your key here. And you get your key here from your Steam key options over here. I just click on Show Key and I go ahead and copy and paste the key in that Twitch options. So we go to add another. So we're going to add, you paste the key and you type your channel URL. It's very simple. You click on add. Then that's set up. Same thing too with the hitbox. You click on hitbox, you select your server you want, and again you go to your hitbox channel and you have your my channel's uh, quad 2k live stream settings. You show your Steam key here and you just go ahead and copy that information there and you hit add. And you can stream on multiple platforms. This is all done with open broadcast software for absolutely free. I am gonna change my current this is my current I'm actually streaming this video on this current key I'm making. I am going to change this. I'll just get a new key for later on. But this is the URL. It's actually really easy to set up. So you go to your OBS. Um, you add all the channels you want. Twitch, Hitbox, YouTube, etc. So I'm streaming on a whole bunch. I'm, not, I'm just making a video of this. So you can see the different viewers. All your different viewers will come up. And it actually has a chat room which is really cool. Uh, you can actually see the chat for all these things. So once you uh, do that you can do your charts here. And this has uh, your chat room, so it'll show your Twitch chat and your Hitbox chat at the same time. So if you have other platforms you're going to use, you can actually monitor both chats. You obviously have to log into your account on both, but you can set up the rows on how you want your chat to look on a second monitor. So if you're multi-streaming, you can see both places. This is a good way to get exposure if you're not getting as much exposure on Twitch TV or Hitbox or you know whatever streaming element you use. I just want to point out that YouTube is a little bit difficult to set up. So I'll walk you through it real real fast on setting up a YouTube channel here. You'll notice I have all three up and running. For uh, YouTube, you're basically going to go over to your YouTube channel. You're going to go ahead and log in as yourself. You want to have to make sure you enable live events. That's in your uh, channel options. If you click on channel, there's an option to enable live. I've already done that. You click on live event. You click on start live event. And then you want to go ahead and go to info and settings. When you go to start live event, you need to make sure you collect custom because it's an encoding option that you select. You can set your time, your date. This is just for uh, YouTube. You can do advanced settings, monetization. Once you have that, you need to click on this um, this setting over here. I added a thumbnail, which is, is my name, and you set up your camera. You want to set it to custom. You can set it to whatever you know stream you're going to do. I select a 720p stream, and then now you want to select your encoders. You have to click on other encoders. It's it's defaulted to nothing, so you click on other encoders. And this is how you get your key. Again, I'm going to change my key uh, by this time it happens. So you're not going to build a stream on my YouTube. And that's how I'm getting the information from YouTube. So you basically get the information from whatever streaming application you're going to use. And you input them all here. You can add, I mean, if you really want it, I could add every single one of these and stream on every single platform all at once. And then all you have to do in uh, OBS is go to your settings, go to your broadcast settings, and set it for a live stream and set it to custom. Because if you notice, OBS only supports the main ones here, which are actually all supported by this application for absolutely free. But you need to set it to custom, and then the URL's information is actually here on this channel. You'll notice the URL's here. It's I selected US West. I want to mention they have um, EU, East Coast, West Coast servers. So you just go ahead and copy this here and the URL, and then you go ahead and paste your Steam key. Uh, I can get a new one. Like I said, I'm just going to refresh it after this video. So all my keys will be changed don't worry paste it and you hit apply and, and you hit OK and you start streaming then you can stream on multiple platforms this is what I'm be using in the future uh, I just think it's it's a better way to get to get more people to see you you're streaming on more than one platform you have a better chance of getting noticed and you can interact with different people from different platforms so I'd recommend you guys uh, checking checking this out you know adding whatever uh, connection servers you guys like this might be a good a good time to get a hitbox account this might be a good time to get a a US stream account this might be a good time to get a live stream account this currently supports all these applications for absolutely free I highly recommend you guys check out 
Restream.io. It is absolutely free. It's a phenomenal tool. It's free, again, and it works great with open broadcast software. I'm actually, like I said, I'm creating this video, and I'm streaming on Twitch TV, and I'm streaming on Hitbox at the same time. I mean, that's that's awesome. Not many people are doing that. And you can also stream on YouTube. I have it on Please Stand By, but I am streaming on uh, my YouTube as well. So if you set out links or whatnot on Twitter, you can let people know what's going on. I don't know if I uh, tweeted it out or not. But if you guys uh, like my video, please make sure to uh, follow my YouTube like the video, share it, uh, follow me on Twitter. I'd really appreciate it. Hope you guys have as much fun with Restream as I am. And let me know if you guys have any com comments or questions. Leave them in the video below. And I will see you guys next time.